Solve using the quadratic formula. The equation 3x is equal to the square root of 9x plus 2 all over 2. We're going to start by eliminating the radical. We'll do that by squaring both sides. Square the left to get 9x squared. Square the right to uh, eliminate the radical giving 9x plus 2 all over 2. Next, multiply both sides by 2 to get rid of this denominator. That gives 18x squared is equal to 9x plus 2. We see we have a quadratic equation. Let's put everything uh, on one side and write this in standard form as 18x squared minus 9x minus 2 is equal to 0. Now let's use our quadratic formula, as indicated. x is equal to negative b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a. Let's substitute values now. We want the opposite of b, and b is negative 9, so the opposite of negative 9 plus or minus the square root of a negative 9 squared minus 4 times a, which is 18, times c, which is negative 2. That's all over 2a, or 2 times 18. This gives a positive 9, plus or minus. Underneath this radical, we get a 225. So that's the square root of 225, all over 36. This gives 9, plus or minus. The square root of 225 is 15 all over 36. So let's split this into its two possible solutions. x is 9 minus 15 over 36, or x is 9 plus 15 over 36. Uh, with our first option, that's a negative 6 over 36 reduces to a negative 1 sixth or x is equal to a 24 over 36, and that reduces to 2 thirds. Now it's wise to check these solutions, as we did have to uh, use our power rule and square both sides of our equation above. I'm going to check this uh, x equal negative 1 sixth in our original equation. That original equation was 3x is equal to the square root of 9x plus 2 over 2. So is 3 times a negative 1 sixth equal to the square root of 9 times a negative 1 sixth plus 2 over 2. On the left, that's a negative 1 half. On the right, underneath our radical, we're going to get a 1 fourth. So is negative 1 half equal to a positive 1 half? No, that's false. I'm going to leave this other one for you to check. Substitute two-thirds into your original equation. It does work. It creates a true statement. Here our solution set is positive two-thirds.